All right, y'all. Welcome on back. Or welcome in. New subscribers, those who are subscribed, not subscribed, returning viewers, everybody out there. All right, so um, I do have another chip I want to review after this. Something that I've personally looked for was like a review and tear down of the Celestial 2. And I did manage to nab one from Deimos. Um, I think I'm level 80 eat now so I guess it depends on how far along you are um I haven't really tested much of that in all of these playthroughs but this big old thing is the Highlander 3 looks like a stronghold but not quite this is a big big thing oh look at all them hope tech pipes underneath there what is this? Aculander 11? Looks like it. Where is Shroud? Does it say it anywhere? Can't tell, but it's definitely an Aculander 11. Those two posts in between. These are probably 300 or 400 CMs. I don't see anything identifying on it. Let's see, are those Nova Bracers? These are Nova Bracers. One, two, three, four. Okay, so we got Nova uh, we got Nova Radiators. Top for two. This is two Hope Tech markers, three Hope Tech markers. That looks like an MKE 4A or 9A. 3030 or 3050 shield probably. We got some Nova engine or Nova struts right here. One, two, and three over there. These are some big fuel tanks. One, two, three, four. What is that? Two Riza turrets. Not sure which ones. These are definitely obliterator 250s. Uh, bumpers on the front. Nova landing gear, side docker. Not a companion way, companion way. Is that two demos holes there? These are probably the Stormax 30s, the smallest ones. Supernova 2100, 22. I'm gonna guess 22. That's an SGD grab drive. I can tell right off the bat. Yep, two more of these Aculander 11s. Or one here in the crowd landing, but that's weird. Two more demos holes I can see there and there. Nova. Ah, uh, what are those things? I forget what they are already. Another Stroud landing gear. Hope Tech. Oh, Hab Cross Brace. A companion way going up to that. That's. This is going to be weird to navigate. Ooh, two cross braces because one up here going to nowhere. Alright, let's get up in the shipbuilder, see what this is about. Now, this is completely random. Um, I did not use console commands for this. Uh, no mods or anything. I just happened to come across this Sunday or Monday, about four or five days ago at Aquila City. So. Anything I can help you with? No. Nope. Sure. How about it? And there it is. Highlander 3 in all of its glory. Well, maybe not. That cargo with my payload perk, I think level two or three. 3,068. Mm. I'm not going to bother reading it. 30 light year jump range, 43 mobility. Ugh. 13, 15 on the shield. That's definitely a 3050. Yep, 3050 C. What is this? Armstrong 20? I'd probably. Jump that up to like a 20E. Get more cargo. Hope Tech Storeroom Fuselage B. And a companion way. Oh, Fuselage D. Yep, raise a 10 petahertz pulse laser turrets for a count of three here. I can see. One rear facing. I was right. Oh, 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 oh. MKE 9. Hmm. 
Okay, what else we got in here? These are you know, obliterator 250 megavolt alpha turrets. Got two of these Hope Tech bumpers on the front. And, yep, these are the 300 CMs here. There's another 300 here and here on the side of these 800 Ts. Other cargoes on here. None, right? Well, not for the CMs, but that was Storm Mac 30s. We got four of those. Well, really not much. In Off to the side. <laughs> Alright, so we got NG15 landing gear, starboard for two. With the Razor 10 Pater Hertz pulse lasers, uh, pulse lasers on them. Is My brain is moving faster than my mouth can keep up. Anyway, the NG15 with the Razor laser turrets on the front of them. Ah, uh, NG-15 landing gear starboard here on either side. I'll pull these things off and see what else is on this thing. Ah, uh, so we have four of the 800 T HE-3s attached to a uh, control station and these four or three uh, Nova bracers here. Again, yet two over radiator tops and one two well, there's four hope tech markers on here up oh, nova struts three of those and one two three four five nova bracers on this thing okay I don't know why there's a Hope Tech Hab cross brace with a window here. That doesn't quite make sense. And this is. This strut is not attached to anything but this Amos hole here, which are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <clears throat> See me, I'd probably throw Habs there. Or. Take this storeroom and companionway here, turn this into a 2x2, two two. maybe battle stations or computer core. This is a, well there's already a 2x2 two two cargo hall here, cargo hall to computer core, control station there, workshop up here, 7 quarters on the bottom to a companionway that goes nowhere. Hmm. Forum companion way. Yeah, that's probably what I would do it. Add to add a few more habs because these are what five mass. One, two, three, four. That's twenty right there. Oh, five times eight. That's oh, five ten. <laughs> yeah, I was right. Forty mass, which is kind of unnecessary. But what are you gonna do? All right, moving on. We're gonna. Dig up underneath before we get to the rest. So, yep, Aculander 11 to three Hope type pipes mid to an Aculander 11 in the front. And we have Aculander 11 on the left and right or port and starboard sides at the very rear. Simple Stroud cowling there and our Stability Pro landing bay there. Oh look, two more Deimos holes down here. Anyway, moving on to the back, we've got the SGD 3300 grav drive here and a SF40 sheared flow reactor right up here. Nothing behind it, underneath it. Nope. I'm at 43 mobility. This is going to be pretty uh, difficult to move around in space. But yeah, I'd probably end up putting two more of these 2200s, one here, one over here, probably upgrade some of these HABs, put some missile launchers on this because there's only laser turrets, which is going to make, and this is pointless, the MKE-9, what is that going to do, sitting all the way back there, 1,512 damage is 
not really going to do much. I guess that's more like a, a pea shooter, backup, pew pew kind of gun. But <laughs> I'm very curious to see how this is going to do. Because, all right, so off from our control station, Hope Tech have cross brace and our Hope 11 docker. I guess they did this one over here for uniformity, which kind of really doesn't make much sense, but. All right, let's go see. Throw some upgrades on this thing, maybe, before we even go out, swap out some of these, or swap out, swap up some of these weapons, whatever. In we go. Everything seems to be where we left it. All right, through our little tech cab cross braids here. We we're just talking. How are you sitting here when you were just behind me? Mm -hmm. And these are creepy. Oh, look. Mariner's compass. Could sell all this stuff. Value 75. That one's 140. Anyway. I'm going to play darts with this table right here. I mean, I guess this isn't about the correct distance. No. Break wind and somebody's sitting here. I don't know. Bad place for a dartboard. We're going to come up, swing a left here into our companion way. Which we're gonna jump up in here. To another companion way. <laughs> to another companion way. What do you know? Think companion way to storeroom or storeroom to companion way. Now we get to our 2x2 two two cargo hall. No hatchet, Sarah. You got something for me? Never seen that before. Well, I have, but. Too much junk in the way I'm kicking it around. Alright, so I'm gonna hop up through this little hatch right here. Not a door, it's a hatch. And there's our side docker. Right up over now. Our control station. I like the whole dark thing here. I still have an interior's dark mod on because my ladders are dark, my attachment points are dark. A little hallway to the window. No vents in here, so if you do crack one, mm, I'll smell it everywhere. Alright, going up one. Companion way. Uh, workshop. Hard, Captain. Why are there two ladders here? Wait. Okay, that's... Yeah, I'm modifying this. Something about this ain't right. Now this is going to go back to our companion way here, which has a ladder that's going to drop us right back into where we just were. That not make sense to anyone. <laughs> All right. So because there's two storeroom companion way, probably it's putting a ladder in both spots, which I don't know. This is going to our Armstrong, Louis Armstrong. All right, come on, let's go. Stop, move. Three, two, one. Took too long. <laughs> go take off. Oh, still plenty of power points to pop up anywhere else. Oh, power points pop up. Peter Piper, pick a pack of pickle, pe pickle peppers. See, I can't say it. It says pop, 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 pop. Not really. I will put that into lasers. And there's still left over for a grav. One, two, three. Alright, so what's our base cruise speed here? 185. Do a quick boost, see what happens. Four. I have 60, so it's not bad. It's kind of like one of the other builds. What I've done here. Well, there's a lot of ships I can probably pop off on. Maybe find a Chimera one of these days in a three star mule, Raider Atlas. 
Galbank, Holger, you see Longsword, Settler, Econo Hall, Econo Hall, the Eye, a lot of traitors, oh, Phalanx, I have a Phalanx 3, I'm gonna have to find out where one of those things are, get me a uh, SSN sloop, and take your news somewhere else. All right, so it's barely pushing 600 on this. We're going to jump off. I think y'all know where I'm going to try this out at. We go up into a billion pieces. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. so I can turn a little bit better. Yeah. A little bit better. Where are you going? Where did you come from? Where did you go? Ooh. Okay, so that ballistic's not too bad. I want your loot. Watch, I better grab this and another one will jump into a uh, base here. Credits and lead. I guess not. They're not as predictable as I thought. Hostile activity. Yes, indeedy. I'll take it. Oh, I see one over there. Oh, thrust up. Oh, they're low levels. I'm too high to uh, level to um. Let's get in there and get them. Come on, give me your loot. Give me your loot. Give me your loot. Well, that one's too far away. Where'd that loot go? Mineral deposit. Mineral deposit. Oh, I don't know. I will take see you. All right, so not bad for a little starter ship here. I will scan that planet. Lots of iron, helium three, and aluminum. A helium three and aluminum. Aluminum loom. I'll do another one. See how it fares. And this big old clunker. We gonna see how you do. In this clunker. You one up there. That one's three. Uh, I don't see just two of you. One on three. Low levels again. Come on. Good. Dang, I had to do nothing. Ooh, 91. Dang, I was level 90? Holy Jesus. Better stop playing this for a little while and play something else. <laughs> I mean, I was playing Lords of the Fallen earlier. But Man, did it get my heart rate up trying to get through a skin stealer with a big heavy sword. And I keep forgetting Lord of the Fallen is not Dark Souls. I mean, it's harder to an extent if you're not using all the tools given to you, but. I would not mind trying something and all right, so of here options. we are. Come on, open shop. Got anything you need to offload? Sure. Have all right, so what can we Really nothing to upgrade. The weapons are okay. The mobility is terrible. Indeed. We already got supernovas, obliterators, razors. Maybe put another. How much is this going to run me? Oh. Put four on there. 88 mobility. Not bad. That's already a, a storeroom. Let's go ahead and take these two off. 
Get rid of these two. This needs... Hold on. Cargo hold 2x2. Two two. We have our workshop here. And what's under here? They're 2x2. Two two. Why is there so much in the way of... Uh, Okay, so companion way, store room, companion way. I can understand if this was here. And then put, let's see, Habs. Uh, that won't work there. That's a control station, cargo hall. There's already a living quarters on the bottom, I thought. And down here. Which we ran through that had the dartboard living quarters all in one berth these don't make sense but these two holes i could do a two by two computer core hold on let's see yeah put that there get these two on here and this has no attachment point and this doesn't either so with that being said Mm, I think I see why they did this. Duplicate them, bring them over. This right here. Man. I'll go hold two by two. Move these off. And throw that over there. Just to give an idea of what I would try to do. Maybe get rid of this, push this back. Doesn't need all these markers on it. Duplicate that MKE9 over. Now we have a max crew of 8. Hmm. Maybe put 4 of these on the front and move these back. Maybe stick this. Oh. Maybe take that off of there. Stick this over here. Duplicate that down. Get rid of that Nova thruster array. Put this one up here. And there we go. We got four of these 250s. Dang, that's almost 200k or more that I just spent upgrading this thing. Ooh. What? Oh, uh, what do we got? Too much power for a whip. Oh. Can't use four of these. Okay. So... I wonder if I put these back up here. I can probably get... Hmm. I have an idea. We're going to save it. And we're going to... Instead of those, go see what the PPOs are up to. Come on. Get there. Um... Those are 99. These are 387. Holy but Jesus. <laughs> okay. Um, let me get rid of this hope tech marker. Duplicate this one. Delete that. Put this one right here. Delete that. Duplicate. Put that thing right up there. And we could put these back where they were. I don't know. I guess they just put thrusters array, thruster arrays on here just to fill in gaps for no apparent reason. But not too bad. I mean, at least give you all an idea. This is what I would do with it. You know, the computer core two by two, add an only one berth on the side, get rid of some of these holes. Or the supernova 2200s, which gives us 88 mobility. Um, Argo could use a bit more, but that would make it a bit heavier. Maybe get rid of these and put more here. I don't know. Anyway, what you decide to do with this is totally up to you. And if you find it, let me know in the comments or if you have one already. And I will catch you all on the next one. But thank you for stopping by, checking this out. Highlander 3. All right.
Definitely, if you enjoyed the video, drop a like and subscribe. And again, as a finale, I will catch you all on the next one. All right. Later.